The popularity and power of using Amazon, eBay, and any number of other online storefronts to showcase and sell your wares has exploded over the last decade. The great thing about some of these is that you don't even have to have your own products to sell. For instance, Amazon allows you to set up an Amazon store and list products made available by other stores. You get a percentage of the sale and the store gets another happy customer. It's a win-win situation with no risk for you. Integrating these stores into WordPress is a bit tricky though, especially if you have lots of products to add. There are plugins for Amazon that deal with Amazon stores, but most of them are outdated and very few of them work well. The best option for adding your products from Amazon is to do it manually via creating posts in relevant product categories, adding the image links that Amazon provides and adding the product description from Amazon. It's also useful and beneficial for you to add the rating, price, and all the other information that accompanies the product. Choosing a theme that looks good for this can also be tricky. You want a theme that can show as many posts horizontally at once as possible. Magazine Basic is a good theme for this. Magazine Basic also allows you to remove the author and publishing date from your posts, which is completely irrelevant information for a storefront. You can choose to use the Amazon store code that Amazon provides, though it leaves something to be desired in terms of usability. You can create a page and enter the code Amazon will give you, and your Amazon store will be displayed quite well within WordPress. The issue is that the default Amazon store that is provided isn't very customizable, and the navigation is rather difficult for potential customers to find anything of interest. If you're using eBay for your primary storefront rather than Amazon though, there may be some better options for you. There is a plugin called eBay Feeds for WordPress that allows you to define an eBay RSS feed and it will parse out all your products and embed them into posts, place them as widgets, or insert them into your theme. The important thing to learn about integrating any external storefront is that it may take some time and effort to get it just how you want it. There are plugins available, but many of them simply fall short of many people's expectations, and most just end up creating posts and creating the WordPress store manually. E-commerce in WordPress is mainly a do-it-yourself venture. There's a few plugins that can help, but for many people, just manually creating posts and manually creating your storefront is going to be your best option. With that knowledge though, hopefully, if a storefront is your goal, you'll find your way and use the tools that WordPress provides for you.